Pay attention to people to what people critique about you. Pay attention to those little subtle critiques. You know, the person don't like your smile. They don't like when you smile a certain way. They make jokes about your features on your face. They make jokes about certain things you do, certain things you say. But most of the time, they will attack that area where your strength is, right? If it's in your voice, people will talk about how you talk. People will talk about you sound country, you sound ghetto, you sound this, you sound that. You know, if it's your voice that God wants to use, if it's your looks that God wants to use, people will start criticizing you. I don't like your smile. I don't like your nose. I don't like your eyes. One of your eyes is cocked. <laughs> you know, people find anything about you, but God will use that cock eye. You know, God will use that and people will notice you. It's funny, but listen, God will use the, the, the simple things the crazy things of the world, right? To confound the wise. People think they're so smart. God will use that cock eye because you know what? That cock eye will be a signature. People will know and, and be able to see you, right? And that eye is cocked. Oh, that's the girl who got the little cocked eye. I need to listen to her. They will use that. That will become a signature for you. This is for somebody. I'm not making fun of you. This is for somebody. Don't allow people to stop you from being what God wants you to be because you have a cock eye. You have no arm. You have no legs. You have no um, voice. Your voice sounds crazy to people. Don't let people stop you. They will attack the very thing that God is trying to use. God wants to use that. He wants to use that country, ghetto, what they call ghetto, that country slang, that, that uh, you know, pronunciation that don't sound right. You not putting the endings on your words. God wants to use that. That's a distinct sound. When you don't sound like everybody else, God wants to use that. God wants to use that. Don't sit and let people shame you out of your gift. You will be a fool if you do. This is your confirmation.